morning and welcome to a special celebration of a saint known as the little giant saint dominic sandro today's feast day celebration is dedicated to our little toddlers and kids it is rightly said that the kingdom of heaven belongs to children and it takes a big heart to shape small minds so here we are gathered together to celebrate the childhood of a little saint who was born among us to serve the lord in this difficult times of pandemic, there's no one else whom we can rely on except the Almighty. Let us all call upon Him to bestow His blessings on each one of us. Let us all join our hands and bow our heads before the Almighty. Then we will lead us into prayer. Join your hands and uh, close your eyes. Father, we thank you for the night and for the pleasant morning light and food and loving care and all that makes the worship help us to do the thing we should to be to others kind and good. We know we say, we know we do good, grow more loving every day. Thank you, God. Thank you, dear Tanvi, for leading us through prayer. Now is the time to make the atmosphere charming and beautiful by inviting our dear father Evangelo, Harshali and Harshita to sing a melodious school anthem. Father Evangelo and dear girls for your wonderful performance. Our little stars of Sina KG are all set to launch you to their dream space by inculcating moral values and showing us how to grow up like Saint Dominic Savio through their act. trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from all evil. Amen. A family that prays together stays together. 
we should have to keep all your house clean and tidy. I will be focused and study regularly. Isn't it nice to see such tiny little hearts practice the right discipline? We shall now listen to Father Michael Fernandez who will share his thoughts and views about our little Saint Dominic Savio. My dear friends, today we keep the feast of Saint Dominic Savio. Actually, this feast comes on the 6th of May, but because at that time you are on vacations, we celebrate it on the 6th of July. Your kindergarten is named Dominic Savio, which means it is your feast day. So I want to wish you, dear teachers and students, a very happy feast of Saint Dominic Savio. I wish you become like Dominic Savio. Little giants, great heroes, cheerful citizens, and outstanding leaders. I would like to share a little about the life of Dominic Savio with you. He was born in the year 1842 and died in the year 1857. So he lived for just about 14 years. He studied with Don Bosco and Don Bosco was so happy with him because he was an exemplary student and Don Bosco even wrote a little life about him titled The Life of Dominic Savio. His name Dominic means belonging to God and Savio means wise. So Dominic Savio was a person who belonged to God and a wise person. As his name indicates, he belongs to God and God is love and God would not like hatred and so he became a messenger of peace and love, always cheerful among his peers, forgiving anyone who might have hurt him. He was wise in his studies, wise in his religious devotion, in his conversations and in dealing with others. From a young age, he was serious about his studies. He did little jobs at home. He ran errands for his people. His good example to the companions was contagious. He was obedient and respectful to his teachers and his parents. And he always showed leadership qualities. That means practically everything that he did, he did with great love and devotion. One, done, one day Don Bosco spoke about the boys and told them it is easy to become a saint. At once Dominic Savio was excited and he wanted to become a saint. So he went to Don Bosco and asked him, show me how to become a saint. And Don Bosco told him a very simple method. He said, do little things well and be cheerful always. Do little things well and be cheerful always. So he founded a small club of boys who were supposed to be cheerful always. And they would not do any kind of harm to people. They would respect their parents and teachers. No cheating, no foul language, no fighting with each other. And in case people fought, these group of boys, this club, this cheerful club, went and made peace with each other. My dear children, your teachers and parents do a lot for you. And Dominic Savio teaches us to love and respect our parents and teachers and to do things out of love and respect for them. To do little things well, not to hurt others and to be cheerful always. Excellence is not being the best, it is doing the best. I wish that you are always happy, cheerful and that you spread this cheer to other people who come in contact with you, especially your school children and people in your neighborhood. This whole world must become a happier place to live in. Happiness does not result 
from what we get but from what we give happy feast dear teachers parents and children may you live this day and this year as dominic sabio did live it cheerfully live it happen happy feast to you thank you dear father michael for taking us to the life history of saint dominic sabio we shall now see a little dominic sabio's reciting the sayings of our patron i am not capable of doing this thing but i want to do everything when the smallest things for the greater glory of god i can do this thing but i want everything are to be for the glory of god i need nothing in this world in order to be happy i only need to see jesus in heaven thank you dear children indeed at a very small age our saint dominic sabio had high commitments to the almighty and we pray that our children follow the same we shall now listen to the message that our dear father principal father ajit has in store for us respected manager the managing committee my dear students and you my dear teachers in the first place let me wish you happy feast of saint dominic sabio and a special wishes to sabio kindergarten whose patron saint is dominic sabio and whose feast we are celebrating today my dear students dear teachers i remember when i was a boarder in don bosco lonavla i read the life of saint dominic sabio and after reading his life his life has left a great impression on my life in fact saint dominic sabio is a model to me and now today i am a priest and thinking about dominic sabio and having been celebrated the feast of saint dominic sabio for so many years in don bosco houses there are many things that come to my mind and i can recall but let me point out only one thing that is don bosco's advice to dominic sabio do the ordinary thing in an extraordinary way what does it really mean and especially to us that means doing our work with lot of enthusiasm with lot of interest and above all with lot of love when dominic savio was studying he put his whole heart and soul into his studies in fact he loved his studies and he enjoyed studying whenever he had to do any work he was enthusiastic he never took it as a burden but took it as his duty and did it with lot of love and dedication and any other activity that he did he did it with lot of interest lot of dedication and he poured his heart and soul into whatever he did he poured his love into that and that is the meaning of doing the ordinary thing in an extraordinary way as we celebrate the feast of saint dominic savio this is my wish and pray for all of you that let dominic savio be a model and a guide and i pray that all of us like dominic savio may be interested dedicated and put a heart and soul in whatever we do in love in our life putting lot of love in those things and doing it well with smile on our faces and with lot of love once again wish you happy feast of saint dominic sabio thank you father principal for your inspiring words now i would like to invite the parents of senior kg to express their thoughts and gratitude towards savio kindergarten hello everyone and good morning to all of you 
As a parent, I am very happy and proud at the same time to see my child performing so well at Savio Kindergarten. I am very happy that the Kindergarten Education is preparing my child for her all-round development. My daughter will do her best to make her parents and teachers proud. I would like to thank Principal Sir and all the teachers for giving valuable knowledge to my child. And thank you for giving me the opportunity to talk here. Thank you once again. Good morning. I, Sunny Ramesh Shilke. Thank to all of you, dear father, teachers and parents, for giving me opportunity to speak. Today, 6 July is St. Dominic Savio's Feast. Happy Feast to everyone. Just to tell about Dominic Savio, he used to pray every day and encourage people also to pray. As you also pray every day, children, before starting your class. He was a bright student and he took his further studies from Father Bosco and lived his life by God's grace. Now coming to me, I myself was a student of this school. It was a wonderful experience studying in this school. There are so many things I got from this school. The education, the facilities, the values of my life and whatever I am today in my life is because of my teachers who made me, molded me and gave a shape to me what I am today. And now I got another opportunity and so lucky to have my both children also to study in Savio Kindergarten and Don Bosco School. The hard-working teachers who are giving education and good values to our children as our teachers used to give us. But really thanks to all present teachers, as in this pandemic, they are fighting the situation and also educating our children, which all of us are facing. Proud to say this is my school and my children's too. May God bless every one of us and give us grace to live and be together. Thank you. Good morning everyone. I am Sunil Nimbalkar, Diana and Jovian Nimbalkar ka parent. Today I have got the opportunity to speak to this moment. Thank you for the opportunity. If I want to speak about school, the love and the love of the children is a responsibility. I am the school, school staff, father principal, supervisors and all teachers to say thank you from my heart. Thank you. Thank you to your parents for your kind words of appreciation and love towards our school and staff. We are highly honored. No, no, we are not done yet. Our little kiddos of Senior KG have taken lots of effort and used their creativity to decorate our little St. Dominic Savio picture. Let us watch them display their talents and appreciate them. with love, for charity and goodness, results with God's grace to die, but not sin. Don't make savvy, you the finest road of the vineyard of the Bosco. I say the strong will and determination be a mortal for our soul. My friend shall be Jesus and Mary, they'll save my soul and lead me unto God. I desire be a perfect Lord for the Lord. Oh, then, don't think savvy, you're the finest road of the vineyard of the Bosco. I 
said a strong will and determination be a model for us all. Marching, we come to salute. You deserve you a model of sanctity. We sing of your glory, retell your life story, and ask you with us to be. We'll dare to be wise and a virtue as a price, no matter what others say. Youth of your kind, strong and Come in my father lead of our world today. Dominic Savio, Dominic Savio, you were a Jew and to Don Bosco. Dominic Savio, Dominic Savio, you are a star with a heavenly glow. for the deliverance of the vote of thanks. On behalf of the Rector, Management, Staff and Students of Savio Kindergarten, I have the opportunity to thank all of you for having attended this online Dominic Savio Peace Day celebration. Dominic Savio is our patron saint and just as his innocent and so young, in the same way our children are so innocent, so young. Children, we are missing you. We are waiting for you to come back. We are waiting patiently when you come back to school and we are able to be face to face with each other. Parents, thank you very much for your cooperation. You also have put in a lot of effort in making this day a success. Continue with your support and we will do well for our children. You and we together will definitely make our children's education worthwhile. I wish each one of you a happy feast. God bless you. Stay safe and have a good day. Wishing you all a very happy feast of St. Dominic Samuel.